Our final presenter is Durva Naik, whose presentation is entitled Philly Inspired Mechanical Interlocking for Intestinal Retentive Devices. Do you know what is the number one problem today in treating chronic illnesses? Ready to be surprised? It is medication non-compliance, or simply put, patients not sticking to their prescribed medication regime. Every year, 100,000 premature deaths occur in the US, and that is simply due to poor compliance. And currently, our best bet at solving this crisis is oral delivery of drugs, as it is easiest for patients to take their medication orally versus other methods, such as injections. And it has been proven that weekly pills over daily pills have a greater chance of increasing life expectancy in diabetic patients, and that is simply due to improved compliance. Now imagine this, taking a single pill that will deliver the drug and its benefits, not just for a week, but for an entire month. At our lab, we are turning that dream into a reality. We are creating an ingestible device that can stay inside your small intestine for a prolonged period of time to gradually elute out drugs. And why are we targeting the small intestine? Well, the small intestine has a very high absorptive surface area owing to these finger-like protrusions called the villi. The villi have a very thin surface which allows easy diffusion of drugs into the bloodstream. And this solves a major limitation of common oral drug delivery systems, which is their inefficiency to deliver macromolecular drugs such as proteins and peptides, which include insulin. Now, prior technologies that have targeted retention in the small intestine either pierce the tissue to hook onto it, or worse, they will stick to the tissue and rot away. That's where we come in with our novel idea of mechanical interlocking that leverages the inherent shape of the villi in order to combat the dynamic muscular movements of the small intestine and remain in the gut. The idea is simple. We have this macroscopic device with microposts on it that resemble the villi. It's elastic in nature, so it can be compressed in this special capsule, which will only disintegrate once it's inside the small intestine. Once inside the small intestine, the device unfolds, and due to a strong muscular contraction, the micropores consolidate within the villi. And finally, due to this mechanical interlocking between the villi and the micropores, the device remains inside the gut. To test this idea, we used computation simulations, and then we experimentally validated these simulations. This proved that mechanical interlocking is a viable strategy to construct intestinal retentive devices. Further, we tested nearly 150 device designs to find out the most efficacious design that can stay inside the human body. Now this device can stay inside your body to gradually elute out drugs and save lives. Thank you.